Welcome, welcome to this historical occasion. The first of its kind throughout the nation. Today, we open in the mill rune site. This place is a sure delight to tell all stories and tales about the ancestors and the old time days. So sit back, relax, and listen well to a wee version of the plantation that we will now tell. Beat your drum, Mr. Drummer. Did we want to make our product here at Woodrow Secondary School, this experience, marketable, and something that can be incorporated with the tour service providers and hoteliers and so on as a viable tourist attraction. I see this as a comprehensive package for any visitor and not just cruise visitors, you know, we have a number of domestic tourists who are also going to enjoy um, product offerings like this. The Mill Ruin experience at the Goodwood Secondary School gives visitors the opportunity to purchase local art, craft and delicacies while enjoying dramatic presentations. We intend to up our marketing campaign creating the awareness that there is indeed a Mill Ruin experience available to the public here and that this experience is one with a difference because it brings the youth in focus. I am very excited to know that we are the first school in Tobago that actually has something like that. The ancestors must be smiling because I'll be learning instead of toiling. The land they used to work, now houses a school of substance and words. We, their offsprings, if to tell their tale of the ruins that still remain. So we owe it to our forefathers to show cast their efforts in the present and future. Beat your job, Mr. Jama. From the Division of Tourism, Culture, Antiquities and Transportation, I'm Juliet James reporting for Let's Talk Tobago.